А это как называется село? Дунта. Дунта? Да. А -а -а. Это самая высокогорная или еще выше есть? Камунта самая высокогорная, древняя, по Осетии. А это Камунта где-то в другом месте, да? Нет, вот здесь а -а -а. сейчас на ней мусор. Да? Да, а -а -а. да. Там есть смотровая площадка. А вот и Камунта. As you have already heard from Alan, the village of Kamunta is the highest mountain village in North Ossetia. It is located in the Digorsky Gorge at an altitude of 1934 meters above sea level. Он уже частично восстановлен, и в нем можно пожить а, в таком стиле, как раньше в старину жили осетины. They named the village in honor of one of the first people who settled in this area, and his name was Kamun. Scientists trace the origin of the ancient settlement Kamunta to the late Bronze Age. Just imagine that one and a half thousand years before Christ. Therefore, when you walk through the narrow, rocky streets of the village, you are seized by an inexplicable excitement. You have the feeling of standing on the steep slope of the rock of time. A thousand and a half years before the birth of Christ lived a simple man, a session, Alan. His name was Kamun. Almost 4,000 years have passed, and his name still lives. Once upon a time, in the early days of Alans, Kamunta flourished, for the village was located directly on one of the most important trade routes between China and Russia, on the famous Great Silk Road. The road that runs along the opposite slope of the gorge is part of the former Great Silk Road. There are numerous burial sites where archaeologists have found a large number of jewelry of the Alan tribal nobility, ceramics, coins, and so on. At present, only 16 people live in Kamunta. However, on holidays, due visits of guests and relatives this number increases to 27. Kamunta village is listed in the Russian Book of Records as a record holder, as on May 9, 2016, the Immortal Regiment Parade took place in Kamunta. The staff of the book recorded the highest mountain procession of the Immortal Regiment in Russia and we climb to the top of the mountain where the village of Kamunta is located, about 2,000 meters above sea level. Locals call this place the Dog Rock. The Dog Rock is a rocky outlier that stands on the very edge of a cliff. In ancient times, criminals sentenced to death were thrown from this rock. Such execution was considered the most human. The execution of the sentence was always entrusted to the relatives of the offender in order to exclude a blood feud with the executors. Why was the rock called a dog? No, not because it looks like a dog. Literally, translated from a session, it sounds like a place to throw dogs. And if you consider that people usually call criminals lousy dogs, everything immediately becomes their place. It is clear that in a session there was more than one such rock with a similar name. However, 
it should be noted that such a cruel punishment was not often used, but only for very serious crimes. Treason, intentional spreading of contagious diseases, violation of the custom of hospitality, that is murder or robbery of a guest, patricide, incest. The painting you saw at the beginning of my story about the dog rock is by the famous Assassin artist Maharbek Tuganov. It is called Dog Rock.